Junior, much more older than his 20 years. Quadrado to the lefty Bala to the right hand side. Another delicious free kick, but wide. Just wide, Sportiello will be absolutely delighted because he was rooted, he wasn't getting there, was he? Just the angle that he approaches the ball at as well. Couldn't quite bring it back in time. Terrell's in there, Simeone's in there. Number two, and he has one goal this season. Not a second, not like that. Nowhere near. He was poor. He's looking at the ground. That's not going to help you. Under 80 for you, Blake. And of course, has been out quite a while, so they're easing him back in, but we do miss him. In towards the fast stick, and they do have the goal now. Mansukic scores for Juventus. Suddenly, they make the breakthrough. Seven minutes into the second half. La Juventus, uh, they moved the ball quickly at last. And he's done so much work off the ball. Mario! Finally gets his just dessert. Mansukic puts Juve 1 0 up. Juve finally managed to find the gap between the goalkeeper and the back four, but it's Gaspar, the substitute, who has just come on. He allows Mansukic to get in front of him, and it really is a poor mistake. Mansukic, what's great work. Really is a good position from the striker coming in at the back post. And the header. Maybe a mistake there by Sturaro, Simeone. And this is Chiesa. The drive always rising from there too. And against Wales at under 21 level recently. Here's Terrell. Ooh! How wide was that? And now to get the shot away. That was the cleanest of strikes. Again, it's a mistake, isn't it? Put his hand up as well, but. You can see wrong shape on the ball. Good use of the ball. Matuidi. Takes on Medellia and leaves him behind. He was holding on for Grim. That's a penalty. That's a penalty all day long. He knew as soon as he shaped to make the tackle, although he was off balance, he was going to concede there. Absolutely right. It is a poor challenge from Medellia. He's going to try and at least challenge him, do it outside the box, but he has a nibble there and then has another go with the other foot. Really is silly. Yeah, you know, as well, just look at the players. There's no remonstrating. We weren't going to the referee. It's that right foot tackle. Down he goes. Definite penalty. Tried to get a left foot foul in outside the box. Didn't want him to carry on inside the penalty area. But they've asked for things to be checked. The first left foot challenge, I think, was outside the box, but it's the sweep of the right foot inside the penalty area, which would suggest to me it's a penalty, but he's, I mean, this is what you can do now in Italian football. You a fan? I am, if it's quick. But unfortunately, I've seen many occasions where it isn't. I think it was uh, Inter, was it, the other night? It was six, seven minutes, just absolutely ridiculous. Everyone was standing around waiting what was going on. Three, four minutes later, the referee came to the screen to have a look at least Daniele Deveri is going straight there if a foul challenge starts on the outside the penalty area continues inside the box and denies a goal scoring opportunity a penalty can be given check the TV yellow card which means a red Well, I'm a bit confused here. He's given a yellow card, a second yellow, a red. It is Pedelia who's gone yeah. off. It's certainly off. It is a challenge, but it's that second one that it looked like there was contact. There's certainly contact there. For me, there's contact there as well. I don't think it's a clear goal scoring opportunity as he carried in the. He does a good job, doesn't he? My goodness, the area of the pitch. And now with 20 minutes to go, I'm surprised Allegri makes one or two changes just to bring some freshness up and get this second goal. 
Schade. Rugani. Pinch to Quadrado, the big looper looking for Mandzukic coming around the back stick. Sports Yellow got a little bit.